description of the stream ever. <laughs> Biss, you're muted, by the way. I know. I just there realized I forgot all the ones that I was going to make you play. Cause it's <laughs> all right, so stream is beginning. Hey, everybody. If you're watching on YouTube, this is like the beginning of the video. So <laughs> no. let's go to Shan Sonic Fan Games. That's a good idea, actually. Let, let them have their own space. Look at the logo. <laughs> a fart it's room. The logo. All you farties can fart in there. Farties. That's a new <laughs> word. <sighs> okay, let's extract here. This is a big file you gave me, Biss. Yeah, it's a pretty big file I gave you. <laughs> oh yeah, the most, the biggest part of it is assets. I'm looking at it extracting. Oh, this is a Unity game, huh? Mm-hmm. That there, Unity. Because I, I could tell because it was extracting Unity stuff. <laughs> so it's called Sonic Encore, huh? Let's see. Sonic... Soncore. <laughs> this is Sonic Buttcore. No! Sounds like a music no! genre. No! Where is it? So, Sonic... Sonic Encore. There Snake we go. Tail. Sonic Encore Demo 1. Alright, everybody, get get ready for very loud volume, because it's very likely Hooray! what's going I mean, to happen. You could, just, you could just mute the desktop audio before you start the stream. To well, say then it would mute you too. I mean, I, I, that's the sacrifice I'm willing to make. Open volume Ooh. mixer. Is volume mixer working? This Thank goodness volume muted. mixer is working. Okay, I've turned it down. I turned it down before it made any sound. Thank goodness. Swank and uh, Knuckles. Press any button to continue. Does this not have controller support? No, it does not. <laughs> You're making uh, me play a game with controls. keyboard. It has controls. Oh, now support. it does. It didn't. The first two menus don't. That's <laughs> yeah, kind of silly. This is the game where when I loaded up with two controllers, it took the Full like screen, no. X axis of one control stick on one controller and the Y axis of another control stick oh on another. Oh my god. Oh, this is that one, huh? Yeah. Oh my god. Why is it 59 hertz instead of 60? Like, where did the 1 hertz go? Okay, yeah, I can't see the you. game either. No, it's not yeah, captured I yet. I had to get it. I, I see. It was in full screen. Elena, I can't see the game. So I had to... Elena, I can't see the game. Okay, you should be able to see it now. <laughs> oh, and I... oh, there it is. Yeah, you, you... yeah. If you can't see the game, that means I'm still just trying to set it up. I have to... Elena, you have to... Elena. I have to use the mouse and controller interchangeably in the... in the menus. Like, I have to click to select things. Like, I can move up and down with the control stick, but I have to click on it to select it. Have you tried clicking start? Yeah. Wait. You, oh, this is too. Need... What in the crunk is this? Soundcore. You okay? What is wrong with how Sonic controls? I don't know. What is is? Like he only moves. I don't know if you can understand what's wrong with the movement just from only, looking. Is he, only but... is he only moving left and right from the perspective of the camera? Yeah. It's the same thing that happened to me. Really? Oh my god! Yeah, but I don't have another okay. controller attached. Wow, like incredible! Game. Gamepad setup. <laughs> I can't read this. Can you read that? Look at this text. No, I think. <laughs> Why is it? What? Why is it like? What? Okay, uh, okay, Elena. I think you're about to back out to the main menu. Oh, joy and axis. The there. Forwards and backwards. What in the? Piss, what have you given me? Okay, there we go. God, and it's got like a billion graphics. Are you sure you don't want to turn the graphics down? It amazes it like it, it amazes me how easy it is because because like I I'm under the impression that my computer's pretty good, right? Because it plays a lot of stuff yeah. really well. It's amazing how like simple it is to like overburden this computer just by like. Is it, <laughs> is it being overburdened like, just, right now? 
I'm, well, it doesn't seem to be running at like smooth frame rate. Well, do you want to change the? Maybe we should change the graphics settings before. It just, just amazes me. Like, maybe like, we should. <laughs> like, you know. it, it amazes me that just some amateur creator can make something with low effort that just totally spumbuses the computer. Elena, why won't you just change the graphics settings? Because it's amusing me to see it like this. <laughs> to like Elena, uh, see at that, that point, this is like at that point we're actually causing my computer issues. At that point, we're actively being disrespectful. It feels kind of mean. Like really? I don't know. It's like it's like if I just played Crisis on stream and played it at full at full fucking spec, and it ran at one frame a second, and somebody was like, "Why don't you change it?" And I was like, "It's funny." <laughs> I don't know. That would feel weird, and it feels like I don't know. I mean, it's just it feels like giving up. <laughs> What do you mean it feels like giving to up? Set the, to set the graphics down. Does I it don't... look like it normal? Oh yeah, this is this is a Sonic Encore. I think it seems this pretty alright. This is pretty pretty looking. Okay, nothing I changed. Have, I have some pet peeves about this. It may not well, be a graphics thing, and it may be a CPU thing. Like with Black Mesa, where I set the graphics down to the lowest possible, and I got no performance improvement. I mean, you only did turn down one echelon, but okay. Like, and that was like kind of a fan project as well. I mean, well, it really was, but I mean, it was like bigger than one person team. Oops, yeah. what? Video option. Why is it 1080p? It's obviously not 1080p. I set it to to 720, which is what I'm streaming it at the moment. 1280 by 720. Full screen, no. Apply. What? It's. Now the game is stuck. I farted. It got. What? No, not full screen. Full screen, no. No. Bad game. I farted. Wraps it with a, with a newspaper. What does it look like on low? Low just seems to have gotten rid of anti-aliasing. I mean, anti-aliasing is Whoa. basically a waste of fucking processing. Oh, and anymore. and there's like now the grass is more sparse. Okay, well it still kind of sucks. Yeah, nope, nothing changed with the performance, so I don't well, think it's graphics. Oh well, I'm glad that I'm. Um, you know what? I'm at least glad um, that it's not just my PC that sucks at running this thing. Oh, yeah, it seems to be I'm the game's great. problem and not the computer. Some people I love that you experience Sonic well. fan games vicariously through Elena. Yeah, I just get to play shit so that I it's can like... feel almost like I can. anti aliasing can die in a fire arrow, it's a load of shit. Because yeah, like, for comparison, uh, my computer runs Minecraft perfectly, I've discovered. Oh my god, Ark. Ark is a fucking resource hog. It's fucking- I- I could not- like, back when my PC was able to play things, it still couldn't play Ark. It's fucking impossible. And then they, for some reason, decided to put that game on the Switch. And it's oh. apparently one of the worst Switch games there is. Incredible. Like, it looks- the graphics are sort of, like, lower quality than the Nintendo 64. <laughs> Incredible. Like, have oh you seen screenshots God. of Ark on Switch? It is the worst looking video game I've ever seen in my life. The point of anti-aliasing, Robert, is to pretend games aren't made of pixels, and that's why I don't like it. Is it comes from a lot of people who get upset when they see a straight line. They're like, "Oh, I can see the pixels," as if, it as, as if paintings aren't made. As if paintings aren't made of fucking brush strokes. Sickening shit. I don't know. I think it's just an artistic decision. Hmm. Okay, I usually like okay, things uh, looking smooth, to be honest. I'm not saying- I mean, saying, this still has anti-aliasing on. I'm not saying that the I don't understand this level design. Why do I keep ending up here? Because you don't jump over the pit that approaches you I am jumping. Forward. What do you mean you're jumping? I keep jumping. This looks frustrating. Let's see, options. 
Video options. Can I get... What if I set it to minimal? Oh boy, now it looks really crusty. Uh, performance is a tiny bit better, I think. Can't tell. Oh lord. Um, when it said minimal, it means that the performance is minimally better. <laughs> Got him! Yeah, it's still really choppy. What if it's because you're streaming it as well? I mean, there's always that to consider as well. Because if if it is if it is having issue because it's very CPU heavy, streaming mm -hmm. uses a fair amount of CPU. So. I think that like one thing that a lot. I think a lot. Wait, of people there's game that, overs. God. Yep. I think that a lot of people that make games like this. Wow, you can um, roll. You can roll forever. They, Look at this. Look at he go. I think a, he really do go. But I think a lot of people that make games like this usually have pretty good computers because, like, stuff like Unreal and Unity, if you're doing 3D games, developing them, I think it takes a lot more actual, like, processing power than just playing them. So they tend to, like... I imagine so. If it, so, like, them and also the YouTubers who show them off, which are their main audience. Uh, I'm going to be cynical and just say that. Um, <laughs> I don't know if you feel a space when nobody there I has mean, I'm basically computers. a YouTuber who shows off the fan games at this point. But <laughs> yeah. So they just don't they just don't think about optimization much. There's some exceptions. I can't get out like of here. That, like Why, that one who's just if they're gonna have all this water it. here and not have any purpose to it other than you have to get back out of it, just just make it kill me. Yeah, I'm gonna be honest, right? Like I think I think that like fucking water pits are like a replacement for pits which are just as bad and they just shouldn't be there. This is this feels terrible. Like just if you're gonna have this here and not have anything down, like if like maybe if you put an alternate path down in the water, it would be interesting. But if but if I if it's just that, just just have the water kill me. Yeah, like Utopia at least had the decency to put springs everywhere down there. Probably not frequently enough still though. And also like they've made the ground lipped on the edges. Which means that you curve into the water when you run off, mm. which is fucking silly. Also, as far as I can tell, it looks like you can't jump right against an edge and actually land on the top because there's the lip. Yeah, <laughs> I keep having issues with that. Also, the seaweed looks... is solid. Unfortunate. That one like... thing of seaweed was solid. <laughs> At that po at this point, probably the best thing they could do to salvage this is just make the underwater segments actual fucking level with stuff going on, or make it or make you die. <laughs> I don't know. I think the problem with making them die is that they've probably got water in here because this is based on because okay, so this okay, is based on. Okay, well, there's on, a little like, bit of stuff down here. They're probably intending to have water levels at some point because they've got the underwater system, so they don't want to code water as they don't want to like imply that water is death now. Otherwise, you won't go underwater in later levels where it's intended. I guess. I mean, I guess you you could always have it be so that you either start underwater or you like have a slope that you can't avoid that just goes directly into the water, and that's how Elena, you get in the water. You, I mean, I'm going to be asked, Elena, the fact that your you isn't helping because you have managed to end up getting back up at the same place, go backwards, and then fall in the exact same pit like three times! I just realized okay. that I'm here. I didn't do this the first time through. I don't know why I'm struggling now. Yeah. Well, I mean, this game isn't trying to be like modern Sonic. It's trying to be. I mean, aesthetically it is, but like the the actual the move set you've got is supposed to be classic S. What the heck was that? I'm in the water again. It's an underwater adventure. <laughs> oh fuck. Welcome to series 12 of Spongebob, folks! <laughs> oh, there's a spring. Oh my god. Spongebob just keeps coming up lately, both like, in our streams. Elena, Whoa, you're going backwards again! That? Elena, you're going the ex- Elena, just Backwards? You are going back- you're going the same way you've gone the other million times! Oh my god, Elena. I've made it- I've got to the- to the spiral. Okay, maybe you're not going backwards? I don't know. I mean, I'm just going where there's rings. Which is what I, I presume is the way to go. Wherever the rings take you. Exactly. 
<laughs> I keep getting a ton of fault or subscribers on my YouTube channel lately, by the way. I'm up to 610 last I looked. Nice. Slowly on my way towards a thousand. If anybody here doesn't subscribe to my YouTube comment. channel, yeah, you should. I like you are going backwards. <laughs> you've lit, you've almost gone backwards. See, I, I can't, can't tell. tell if she's yeah, going exactly. backwards or Me not. Neither. <laughs> I think that's the problem with going underwater, is that like, before you this go underwater, you? it's like, yeah, that's the, yeah. It would probably be good if there were like, landmarks. <laughs> Yeah, well, good. Oh, hey, there's those rhino robots again. Yeah, the ones that are iconic to Angel Island Zone are, are in every version of the level and are unmissable. And I never noticed them before today. The last oh. day that I was ever streaming that game, I finally noticed the <laughs> rhino robots. You've got hit by them dozens of times! I never noticed they were rhinos. Or oh. what they were. In fact, well, actually, yeah, I don't remember seeing them ever. I don't recognize a single part of their design. Maybe it's just because, like, most of your ex That is weird. Well, I don't even remember this part of the level. Was this here before? I'm not sure how I feel about this demo. It's really spumbusing me. I mean, I don't really have that much good a time with it either, to be honest. It's a shame because I think they've, I think they've got something. I think the problem is just that like the rough edges Music is rocking. are really fucking bad. It's one of those things where you can tell that like the person that made it definitely has fun playing this, but nobody has, but has right. had no useful feedback. Yeah, because I mean, it's very, it's not very optimized for one thing. It's probably optimized yeah. for their computer. Yeah, that's number one. Number two, the entire water thing is bad. The in the hitboxes for the environment are too complicated. They need to be simplified, ideally. I un yeah. I, un I, I I appreciate that they're trying to make something that you know looks kind of like the original level, but you, but like the original level, the collision was in tiles and didn't match what was physically there. You can't just make three D models that look like what was there originally. The absolute and then have that suffering the of the. The way you I can't like even get run back to down where... the wall when you run off something. <laughs> I can't. Oh my god! I can't like, figure it's out how even they... worse. Like it's even worse than the feeling when you meant to jump but you run off the edge instead. <laughs> it's even worse than that oh, well, feeling. I've, just, I've managed to find the <laughs> checkpoint again. At least it looks. I managed it. to find the checkpoint. Can somebody please just make a JoJo to be continued meme of like going over the lip? Elaine, are you going backwards again? <laughs> I'm not going backwards, I'm going into the water. Okay, of a complaint, right, okay. I'm, I, 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 don't, I, I don't like how these streams end up becoming a big critique section, session where it's so fucking easy. The camera needs to be up higher and zoomed more fucking out. The over-the-shoulder thing does not fucking work, and it's the default camera in all of these community engines for no reason. The camera needs Honestly, to be zoomed all out. of this Get is such this. just such a good example of like Get out of there, the Son sort of like realization Sonic. I made, where like Sonic has to do everything so much better than anything else because you have to do it at Mach ten. <laughs> I okay, I have a ho I have Sonic, actually a counterpoint about this Sonic. game, okay. which is yeah. like you're not actually moving that quick in this game. The problem Springs. is just. The, like, like you could reskin this game to be something other than Sonic, right? Make it less easy if, to just you, go off the edges. And if you didn't have the loop the loops people would just be like, oh, this is just some other game. I mean, obviously... The what, this game? Okay, okay, so there's sections where you go fast, right? But even in the yeah. sections where you're going at your default speed, which I think is quite slow, um, it's the problems are still there. I think with I think this is things issues. I agree with what you said to some extent, right? Um, maybe for different reasons, though. I don't think it's the speed, right? Because I think that, like, a game... Sonic? How fast the game is doesn't... Returning like, radius is, like, is interesting, Sonic. There you go. Well, well, I've said before that, like, okay, so speed is, like, subjective, right? Like, I've said before that I've made... Well, I guess not, uh, not made games, but I've made parts of games before. Um, where it's like... Oh, 
Can I see you back? What? Well, see, every hello, time he goes down here and then dies. Hello? Hey, hello, hello, Cassie. I finally you managed me? to get oh, back hi. here. What were you uh, saying? Oh, yeah, I was saying, I, I think I agree with what you're saying, but for different reasons. Because I don't think that fast games. Did this, have does this to checkpoint play point me backwards? I, I hate don't that. Think that I've played well, several gonna... Sonic fan games where the checkpoint points you backwards to start with. It might just be because you went through it backwards and silly they made it so it copies your position when you've gone through it. Because <laughs> they don't what think you'd be a dummy and go through it backwards. <laughs> My point is that you can make a game fast only through thematics and visuals and like implications. I think with Sonic it's just that, it balance, is that if you're trying to make an authentic Sonic game, without abandoning any of the elements. I mean, I already have I issues uh, do, navigating then there's things, things there's a lot sometimes. Of things to balance. You've got a situation where it's like you're you're making something that's like partway between a platformer and a marble game and also is supposed to have style and also like a load of other stuff. And it's just I mean, kind of I guess, but I think you are discounting that like speed like is you have you definitely have to be more careful when your character is faster. No, but like, my counterpoint just... is that like okay, look, it's my counterpoint yeah, is just that like mini Mario runs ten times faster than normal sized Mario in New Super Mario Brothers. What? Yeah, I know that speed is relative, but like, I mean, if you just look at what's going on on screen right now, it's pretty fast. You know what I mean? I, I, I know I, that it's relative. I play, like, I play, I play, I play, there's the fact like, that, that I always like to bring up, which is that uh, Mario in the original Super Mario Bros. runs faster than Sonic in the original Sonic. You just zoom out. Hey, does he even though? Yeah, I really it's think that's faster. false. That what does that even make sense though? How do you measure that? Well, I mean, if he covers Tiles per moment, <laughs> he covers his own. His own size more per second. Sonic is just very small. Okay, that's kind of I kind of like that. That's kind of funny. The boss just okay, disappears he's... when you kill it. I see. He had a... That's just such a that's just such a random metric, though. That doesn't make sense because if Mario was really tiny, like he, it would still it wouldn't feel like incredibly different. You know what I mean? In fact, his gait his size does change. And he still covers, you know, he's covering the same distance oh, in the same levels. amount of time. Just because it's like relative to his own size doesn't make him faster. It's just kind of absurdity. Oh, That's the, just kind the of performance has gone bullshit. down again. Also, my computer is like really like like the fans are going hard with this. But like, okay, okay. My computer's so working hard to render this. As I was this. saying, I know that speed is relative, right? But I is agree, there anybody arguing that Mario actually plays faster than Sonic without random game theory bullshit? Well, okay, no, I think, okay, I don't think AB is saying that, right? I think they're just saying that, I think it just is relevant to the overall thing, <clears throat> which is like speed is something that is created, speed is something which is created it's by like, the context. But yeah, it's like, things. it's like that roller coaster at Disneyland, the uh, Space Mountain, where apparently it's actually. Like it feels really fast and exhilarating, but it's actually a very slow roller coaster, and mm -hmm. they make it seem faster by one having it be in the dark, and two they have like wind, like like on the train there's like fans that blow wind in your face when you go around the corners, and things like that to make it feel like you're going faster. <laughs> I think okay, so what Elfie Fay just said, I was gonna say it's during the boss fight, but during the boss fight, the camera like zooms out and looks down more, and if the entire game just had that camera. It would be like ten times more fucking playable, to be honest. They've also changed Desirable. space. Space Mountain is now uh, a Star Wars themed ride too, by the way. They changed uh, it at some point, so when I went on it, it was the Star Wars Space Mountain. <laughs> Interestingly, there is a Star Wars ride at Disneyland that it has been there longer than Disney has owned Star Wars. Like, I think it's okay. originally from the 80s. I think that, like... Okay, so granted, it would look about as fast as Crash Bandicoot by default speed. I think the thing that, like... I think the benefit of that is that then the game would still feel fast because there'd be the moments where you had the option to go faster than top speed, 
And because it's faster than top speed, it would be contextualized as fast. <laughs> and it would feel fast. And my also, cat's inside of a room. Also something I wanted to mention about that, I'm just saying that, right? Sonic Utopia swings both. I know, I mean, okay, let's be real here, right, okay. Sonic Utopia is fucking great and I love it. Also, I'm just saying, though, that, like, it's kind of ambitious and good, and I think that certain things could afford to be less ambitious Whee! so that they can uh, focus on being the second one. Because not all of them a fun can loop. do both, like Utopia. Right. Uh, I wanted to mention about the, the older Star Wars ride. That was actually my favorite when we went to Disneyland. I think it was the most convincing, like, I guess technically VR thing I've ever experienced in my life. <laughs> Well, like, do you recognize then what I'm saying? Like, I, I don't mean that I have measured it. I don't I mean that AR there is some is metric it, by which reality. we can say that technically, scientifically, Sonic is faster than Mario. That's random game yeah. theory bullshit. But yeah. well, no, I think they from were just an counting, experiential like, point of view, you're going to catch no. me. Like the literal speed no, but across in order, the screen. But in order to measure speed, you need a consistent distance unit. Well, yeah, pixels. Like, you need consistent distance units. Yeah, but... And... <laughs> you have it wasn't even pixels, pixels in the game theory video! Oh, well, I wasn't talking about that. I was just talking about it in literal sense. No, but I feel like... I feel like... Is it, well, they were just you talking physically it, with the this game. Is, this is the thing that weirds me out, is that, is, is, that, is, that, is that... You mentioned the across-the-screen thing, but across-the-screen Sonic is faster in the classic games because it's less fucking screen! Right? <laughs> Yeah. Is he? Yes! I thought it was like pixels per second or something like that. No, I, I could have sworn it frame. was like scale of body. Well, that's not what it's... I heard. <laughs> I okay, heard it. Well... I didn't hear it with like theory things. It was just like physically just like counting it. Pixels, I... pixels are still not a consistent distance metric because, well, Sonic is clearly more zoomed in than Mario. Or, you know what? Maybe it's not. Maybe everything in this world is just that size. That's why we can't know. <laughs> That's why it's futile to try and measure it objectively. But through but the subjective experience of speed, do you see what I'm saying? I just yeah, mean I, I that like that. Mario like moves more pixels at a time than Sonic. I don't agree like with you. Was... Well, there's Super Mario not Brothers is a lower. Super it's Mario just... Brothers is a lower resolution. Than, like, okay, so it's I don't I, I don't think that the, I don't think that the games are that different a resolution because like if if one of them's moving the screen faster, they have to be moving more pixels as well because it's not like the Super Nintendo was like HD in 1987. <laughs> well, it's just the NES. <laughs> oh my God, I am. Bringled. Okay, can I just say something? Okay, Shan, uh, the reason Sonic runs like Naruto is that apparently the running animation he used to have, the other one, uh, didn't look good from behind in 3D, so they gave him a Naruto run, which is based on how ninjas used to run, but ninjas didn't run that way to go fast. It was apparently a stealth thing, because you're lower to the ground, it, they'd run like that to stay undercover. Oh, does putting your arms back, like, change your sen- Like, yeah, so that yeah, must be for balance. Head forward. Yeah. Huh, interesting. It's like if you look at a crouch run in a modern video game, it almost looks like a less refined version of the ninja run, almost, kind of-ish. Because you got a thing where your body's forward and your arms are back. Yeah, I love the way you yeah. suggested comparing Eggman and Bowser's sizes as if Bowser has ever had a consistent size. <laughs> <laughs> and even if he did have a consistent size, I still feel like that wouldn't mean anything. Um, Can I just say... Oh. oh yeah, what's the shish? About what Cassie was saying. Yeah. You're ruining the joke, Elfie says. <laughs> <laughs> I knew it was a joke, but I wanted to be a nerd anyway. I wanted to make a funny joke about Bowser being inconsistent. And Arrow says, the Wreck-It Ralph scale is absolute. <laughs> Wreck-It Ralph. Wow. 
I remember reading an interview that apparently they had issues with that scene because the uh, they kept showing it to the different game companies and they kept saying make my character make our character bigger than this one and like it was like Bowser's got to be this much bigger than this one and they're like well this character's got to be this much bigger than Bowser and things like that and it was just like <laughs> it was just like I don't know how big to make them because they're just gonna be like I think they said they're, at this rate they all of them are gonna end up being just like giants. <laughs> the fucking, the fucking ego, the fragile egos of game execs. <laughs> Incredible. <sighs> Literal infinite loop of size increases. <laughs> <laughs> the infinite villain expansion zone. Also, I've sent you a link to another thing in case you okay. run out of this, Elena. This music sounds Which like Doom. Which you probably will. <clears throat> Um, but yeah, that ride at Disneyland that I really liked, I forget what it was called, but it's the, the one where you put on the 3D glasses and then you go in like the spaceship and it like moves as you go along. And that's the most like convincing thing that I've ever been on. Cause like, it really felt like you were on the space, like they could make you go in a warp drive and everything and like, it feels like reasonably like what you'd imagine that would feel like. And like, and there's this part where you like f drop, like you come to the planet and you like drop like straight down and almost hit the ground, and like, <laughs> it was really cool. And apparent, and also found I out that that machine it doesn't run on like a set like path. It's actually hand operated. Somebody has a joystick and is moving the whole thing around. Somebody operates it, <laughs> which was like mind blowing to me. Which I think is maybe what makes it more convincing, because it's not sort of like an exact motion. Like there's a little bit of like wiggle to it, I guess. Which you would imagine, which maybe makes it more convincing to your brain or something like that. It really is just the most blue thing that has ever existed. It's got a hole of solid fucking lapis lazuli. <laughs> like. I know all of the, the issues with Disney, but uh, like Disneyland like rides are really amazing to me. <laughs> like the way they put together and everything is really cool. I'm a big fan of those. <laughs> well, I mean, if we're being technical, it's an Eggman in an egg. egg Why is everything box, from Sonic Three? Well, I'm pretty sure this is a Sonic Three thing, right? Which makes the egg bot an egg man. Well, I mean, like it's supposed. The idea is that the, the eventual end game for this project is to remake a load of classic levels in 3D. So mm -hmm. this one is just a remake of Angel Island Zone. So. Yeah. Angle Island. I hate the fact that they like cop out and they're like, "Yeah, the boss has shield sometimes." So now it's like a fucking Zelda boss, and you need to. Why is this here now? Reveal the brimble stain before you hit them. Like, uh, I enjoyed learning about how the. Uh... The beginning of the haunted mansion at Disneyland works, and also the stuff they do there is similar to some of the stuff I've been doing in Minecraft, where you have to like, sort of like, use like sight lines and like illusions to make things look bigger than they are, or look like there's nothing behind them, or things like that. Like look like they're in the middle of like a forest or something, when really there's just like a big like show building thing right behind it. <laughs> And like the uh, the beginning of the the haunted mansion thing is actually taking you underground, because like there was physic there's physically no way to fit the ride into the actual um, like like the facade of the mansion, and there's like a big building behind it, but like they have to keep it separate so you don't see it. So they have like this little tunnel you walk through, but also they have to somehow get you underground without you like noticing, and so they have that stretching room. Which is actually, uh, it's not stretching up, it's actually stretching down and moving you downwards. And like, it's so slow that you don't like feel the force of going downwards. Which I think is really cool. And they like make the walls out of vertical stripes, so that way, like when you see, like you can't notice it like unrolling, because it just sort of looks like it's like staying still and just stretching. Like I really like that stuff. <laughs> Apparently it's like the world's highest capacity elevator. <laughs> but only for going downward, it doesn't go up. Because that would take too much effort. <laughs> are you still there by the way, Cassie, Biss? Am I just talking I to nobody? Oh, there you are. <laughs> I Boy, this is a really long boss battle, isn't it? Oh, you know, will you forgive me? 
Yeah, I'll forgive you. Are you there, Abyss? You're farting. Hello? Forgive me for farting. Where'd Abyss go? Nabisco. I don't know. Maybe, maybe they're... Just maybe they fell in the body. <sighs> oh, and now I've fallen in that. Alright, I don't think I really feel like trying to beat this boss. <laughs> Abyss is muted. I farted? I don't know why, but Biss didn't say anything. <laughs> didn't, like, text me or anything. <laughs> yeah, Arrow says Biss got blown away by my fart. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, the performance, is kinda, the performance of that boss battle is kind of making me sick. And the boss battle takes a long time, yeah. so I'm kind of done looking at that now. <laughs> oh, Biss is going to make me play Sonic Bowl? I know kind of what that is. They're gonna force you to play Sonic Bull. No, there you are, Abyss. It's the Fae! Oh, so huh? huh? oh, I see. Yeah, it's like... <laughs> we were wondering where you went. I was just busy uh, nerding out about the Haunted Mansion. That's <laughs> Sonic Bull. <laughs> the Haunted Mansion yeah. is the first ride that we went on when I went to Disneyland, too. That was my Wait, first what? experience there. <laughs> oh, Shan said, maybe it is the cat. Knew it. I have the best intuition. Sometimes that song just pops into my head and then I and then I just have to hum it. I farted. <laughs> Good work. They farted. Great work, Cassie. Everybody here appreciates it. What if I played Pokemon and named them Biss and Cassie? <laughs> <laughs> I'm going to stream Pokemon at some point once the DLC comes out for Sword and Shield. Which I th think is like coming next. Like, or it's coming like in July, I think. The first one. And then one of them in the fall. But whenever that comes out, I will play that. But there's some, there's a there's a file in this game called Shaggy. Just ignore Shaggy. <laughs> ignore Shaggy. Pay no attention to the Shaggy in the files. To the Shaggy behind the files. <laughs> <laughs> You like this one, right, Biss? Sonic Ball? I think it's probably the best game I've... Wait, let me think. I think it's probably the best game I've played for the first time this year. Nice. It's pretty, it's pretty fucking great. Fish World. I'm reading all these file names as they go by. There's a lot of fences and flowers and princesses. There's so many files that are just called princess. <laughs> and Sonic Bowl. What is, what is bowl? Like a bowl weevil? I'm a talking baby. Are you a talking bowl weevil? Oh. Rest... And cool down well. <laughs> Good luck cooling down, Elfie. We've had, I think this may be the highest, like, average viewership any of my streams have ever had. Wait, this one? Yep. Oh. Run anyway, please. Yeah, like, we've had 11 viewers this entire stream. It hasn't fluctuated. Wow. This is a big one. <laughs> I, I think this may be my most successful stream ever. 
I joined a Discord surrounding trying to figure out this weird, um, because, like, people were digging around in the files of a random Spongebob Flash game, and they found some spooky dude. <laughs> <laughs> These people made a whole Discord trying to figure out what it is, and they're doing the so much dude? digging. And, like, yeah. But, anyway, the thing that interests me, or at least one thing that interests me, is the developers of the game aren't credited anywhere. It took them a lot of digging <laughs> just to find out who the devs were. Like, that's kind of... <laughs> Dad. Like, can you imagine doing work to put together a game? Can you see like it? it like it yes, was a small it. flash game, you know, but it would be unfortunate not to be credited, even if it is just a small just flash game. You know? Why is it like this? Why is there like a black border? Also it's not oh, it's it's like capturing a weird like title card rather than the actual game. That's weird. Sonic Oh, there, now it's the game. Also, we've lost the music somehow. Oh, now it's back. Bum, 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 bum. Start game, please. Hey, Luigi! Sorry. We're in a Sonic game! We're in a Sonic Are you there, Biss? Game. Is Biss muted? Can you see it? Oh, there was Biss. Who should I play as, Biss? I don't know. Also, I can't read the chat, so you two have to read the chat for me for this one. Um, wait. What? Okay. Um, uh, Sonk, maybe? Stanley the big man. Stanley is <laughs> not big. He is man, though. Oh, Super Mario Bros. 3, huh? Well, let's play default. Forever to begin with. Go! Oh! Hey, can, can I make a suggestion? What? Go left. Press X to jump. Z is this run and fire button. Go left. I almost got killed by apples. Is that it? Just the oh, apples? No, I think you're... Nah, you were supposed to get killed by the apples. Oh. <laughs> you getting killed oh. by the apples and lost something. I just followed them. Oh, I see. Yeah, thank you. Will they come back? No, they won't. Read the messages out to me so I can respond to them. By the way. Okay, well, they Uh, Shannon says Sonic is cute in this, to which I agree. <laughs> so, okay, I'm gonna is just Is there a fucking... secret zone in the pipe, like in the real game? Or the real Mario? I'm just gonna Let's be see. real here, right, okay? This is just, at this point, kind of just the best yes, version of Super Mario Brothers that exists. I can always... I never <laughs> remember which one has the, the warp. I always have to end up trying both of them. Oh, he's got the little shield from Sonic 3. Dude, I, wish, dude, I, wish I, could, I wish I could move with the D-pad. I don't like that I have to use the analog stick, but... Oh. What a strange decision that they moved up the uh, pipe. The exit pipe. <laughs> pretty fun, delicious. Do I have to, uh... Oh, what was I gonna say? Yeah, he really should. Then maybe he'd have, like, an interesting thing to do. Yeah, well. This is interesting. Oops. <laughs> I was about to say something, and I started the sentence, and then forgot how I intended to end the sentence. Oh yeah, and also there was the weird uh, hole in uh, the ceiling in the bonus area. That's Tiny Baby Sonic. Baby Sonic. Everybody likes Tiny Baby Sonic. Everybody wishes Sonic was always a tiny baby. I don't think most people... I'm a tiny baby. Everybody wishes that Sonic was always a tiny baby and never stopped being a tiny baby. I swear Glitch I know how to play Super Mario Bros. Literally says kill the gremlin Sonic. So actually no, we've got this goal exactly in chat over this. <laughs> Everybody likes Tiny Baby Sonic and wishes that he's always Tiny Baby Sonic and never stops being Tiny Baby Sonic. Yeah, you're calling Elena a liar? You tune in to see Elena propaganda now. Uh, Elena, can you do me a favor and go to the minus zone? I- Wait, what? Go to the minus world. Ow, you have to- that's like a glitch. 
I don't know how to do any of this actually. There's a way of doing it. I can't remember how. I think I it's like warp break... zone. And when you're not, I think you have to be big to do it anyway, and you're not big, so it's like right. you can't break the block too quiet to do it. No, I mean no. <laughs> The fucking, the fucking increased sonics. On the 3DS uh, Virtual Console version of Super Mario Bros, I have a save state saved right before, or the glitch, or the minus world thing, so I can do it anytime I want. <laughs> what the heck? What is this? Super Monkey Ball now. That's she didn't tell me Super Monkey Ball was here. This That's is bizarre. Bizarre. Wait a Ball. minute, Biss, you told me you didn't know why it was called Sonic Ball. Yeah, and I found out. I don't know if I've ever bothered oh. to correct myself to you, though. It's super also, Elaine, super... you're, you're on a timer, Elaine. You might want not. You might want to be careful. You might want to be careful. The timer is six million years, though, Biss, so we're okay. No, it's 24 seconds as I speak. That's the same thing as six million years, Biss. No, what is, is this? Golf? Golf? See? We have plenty of time. Oh, I guess the ball does look like a golf ball, actually, doesn't it? It's got the same dimpling. Just because oh, it's like low yeah. falling. Yeah. <sighs> Interesting <sighs> lighting this, on the ball. This is a but this is an absolutely bizarre game as far as theming goes, where it's like Yeah, it's just this is weird. <laughs> I don't know how they decided to put these things together in the way that they did. Still reading the chat for me? Oh yeah. Who's reading the chat for One thing I'm not sure I like is the bottomless pits look kind of hard to spot. Well, I, Wait, I mean, I already know that they're there. Normal game. In the in the game. In Sonic Ball. Yeah. That's fair. Because there's like a brown in the background, I guess. It's like a different brown, but still a brown. Right. Like, this one's obvious with the mushrooms. Mm. Like, it's not like all of them are tough to spot, but... Oh! Sometimes. The one at the start of this level, I realize I'm, like, what, 15 seconds behind because of stream delay? Why would they make it so you can die in the intermission between stages? That's just mean. That's mean. That's mean. I'm Sonic, and I say that's mean. I wish Sonic had that voice. <laughs> Hi, I'm Sonic. It's more like Tails. What if Sonic and Tails switched personalities? Him. One time I tried to play Mario 1, like, as an endless runner, like, just holding right and run, and all I could do was jump, and it was pretty interesting. Um, I got pretty far before I had to break the rules. <laughs> that, that's pretty much almost just how speedrunners play Super Mario Brothers. Right, well, I mean, there are moments yeah, where you true, have to turn around to do some tricks. they also skip a lot of stuff. That's fair. Well, it's, okay, no, no skip speedrunners, then. Yeah, yeah. That's interesting. Mm. That's not the Mario Brothers. Way that Mario Brothers work. is the Super Mario Brothers is the most XY platformer I've ever seen in my life, and it owns it. It's pretty good. I like the original Mario Brothers a bit. Can you elaborate what you mean by XY? I think I know what you mean, but because the entire because the entire game is a lot of because uh, wow. the game, if you were to sum it up, is a game about wanting to get more X, um, but you've got to cross reference the X and the Y. You have a speed you're going left to right and a jump arc, and you gotta make sure that the arcs. I can speed run. Uh, I can speed run Super Mario Bros. A in a casual manner. I'm. I can't. I can't listen to both of you at the same time. I'll actually let Lena talk. It's her stream. Well, oh, that's all I wanted to say. Yeah, but now I don't care about saying it anymore. I play as Luigi. 
Let's switch to the other style. Oh, there's more styles. Looks like Mario Maker. I want to see Super Mario Bros. 3. I can go back to where I was, even. Wait, Tass. Wait, what? Okay, what I mean by X Y is that like do is that like everything that happens in Super uh, like Super uh, in Super Mario Brothers like horizontal and vertical speed do not interact. It's just that you need to cross reference them and make sure they pan out so that the arc of what you're doing leads you to landing on something safe. If that makes this sense. This is interesting. Right. And like the fact that you can just and the fact that uh, the fact that people who speed run Super Mario Brothers can just sort of hold right and just make it so that every jump arcs just the right way that they never have to stop holding right. Feels Hello? like the ultimate like execution of that, if that makes sense. Yeah. How do I get out of this? I don't know. Mm. I don't know. What, what have you done? It's accidentally in task mode. Oh, well, I don't know. What is this? Are you recording the run? I think I so, don't yeah. Know. Like, this game's big in the speedrunning community. Like, it's a game designed for speedrunning, so. That's a weird concept to me. Okay, I, I, don't Pretty try cool. Luigi. Mario's better than. Okay, whatever. I want to try Luigi. play as Luigi. Okay, play as Luigi. I like Luigi. It just feels like Luigi is Mario. That main menu there. is a bit confusing. Designing a game to be speedrun is a weird concept to me. Okay. Like ground pounds. To me, it's a thing where, like, if my game feels like it's already fun to do fast, I just, like, deliberately test it, trying to what? do it fast, and, like, mm. see where I can shore things up. Yeah, that's fair. But, like, if it's a game that's, like, not, like, something that feels like it would be fun to do fast, obviously I don't do that, because, mm. like, it doesn't really make sense to alter the design for something that most people probably won't do. <laughs> also, like, most games people love speedrunning are just games that are popular anyway, and popular for the reason that they're just good anyway. Yeah. <laughs> and I mean, like, some of them, like, Ocarina of Time does not seem like it'd be fun to be fast. It's just, like, it stumbled into being a big speedrunning game because enough people played it to find all the eggs. Well, because it was one of those first game. ones... That sort of got popular because it had, like, absolutely ridiculous exploits in it. Yeah. Luigi's got incredible hops. He really do. Again, I really wish I could use D-pad. The fact that I have to use the analog stick is really throwing me off. Are you sure you can't use D-pad? I suppose why I use... Do I use no. D-pad on this? I think D-pad do. doesn't do anything. It has to be analog. Maybe I'm just forgetting then. The fact that I don't remember having to use analog means that if it was analog, I guess I just didn't give a shit. Are you still reading the chat for me? Yeah, I glitch. I keep seeing messages say, going there, but I can't read them, obviously. <laughs> literally say Loogie Cool, Small Sonic is a demon. Which I disagree <laughs> with, but people are entitled to their opinion. I'm tired. I should really have another meal. Yeah, you should consume food. If you had a meal on yeah. a wheel. Yeah. Wait, why am I at world 1-2? Elena, did you click the shuffle option by chance? No. I just clicked go. Oh well. Anyway, hey, also, happening? I... Also, the first time you went through here, you managed to hit every block other than the one with the power up in it. Which I wouldn't usually dunk on you for, but I'm sure you've played Super Mario Brothers before. I usually play it without picking up power-ups. Wait, really? Yeah. Okay. Because I, I do speedrunning it. That's fair. That's, that's Oh, you mean like legit straight up speedrunning, I see. Yeah. I mean, I don't, I don't attempt some of the more difficult, uh, like, things with it. Like, I'm content being a speedrunner who's only impressive. To people who don't speedrun. <laughs> that I think that I think the key to being a good speedrunner is having fun and taking pride in your personal growth. <laughs> I, yeah, I, that's that's my thing with V. I like to just focus on my personal runs and not worry about you know records or whatever. Shan messages in chat saying unicycle. 
Oh, sorry. Unicycle meal delivery. One meal. One meal. One wheel. One wheel. One wheel. One meal. Me sorry, I'm getting confused. Because like <laughs> one wheel, one meal. Because like you may have noticed, um, or or wait, well, I guess it doesn't matter in this one, but I always if you order do the two, uh, if you order two meals, they arrive on a bicycle. <laughs> I always do the uh, the shortcut in, uh, or I don't even attempt to do the the glitch shortcut on four dash two. Like I just hit the block that the the vine comes out of, rather than I doing the trying to attempt the thing where you go in the pipe right. and wrong warp there instead. <laughs> I order five meal. Where's your god now? <laughs> you order three meals and Kazi arrives on a tricycle. <laughs> Make haste, <laughs> Luigi. Make haste, not paste, Luigi. How dare you. At some point you need to try out Mario, by the way. Okay, I guess we'll do that and then end the stream. Oh my god, Luigi's doing that pose. <laughs> oh, actually, could you, could you try out Mario and also Shaggy? Excuse me? Could you try out Mario and also Shaggy? I saw Shaggy in yeah. the files. You if should I was try trying, Shaggy. Go to Sonic, click on Have him, you ever and then go click... the wrong way? Oh, okay, oh, that's on... an N. I thought I thought that was an M. Oh, okay. wait, you act like so Shaggy being in this game is weird. Click on Sonic and then click on the icon for Sonic in the thing. Well, I'm that playing as Mario below. first. Okay, play as Mario first. Then. You can still click on the map. Okay, no, it's too late for that now. You've probably got a million miles ahead. The delivery is cancelled. Five meals not allowed. The delivery is cancelled. Wow. I guess my I keep accidentally, I again. accidentally ground pound all the time. Elena, because get, of the, get uh, hit by the, the analog stuff. Get hit by the apples. Elena, Elena, press down when you're running at full speed. Well, like, there's no room to run at full speed here. Well, go to a place where there is then. P speed or just full speed? Just, just a, just, just a speed where you're going fast. I don't think there is P speed here. There's a P meter up there. There is a Peter up there. Oh. <laughs> Mario doesn't have room to run full speed in the original Super just, Mario Bros. Just run wherever and then press down. Oh, whoa. Wait, I, I just said, oh, whoa. And you can <laughs> jump out of it as well. This this is like the thing that makes Mario actually fucking interesting in this. It single-handedly turns Mario from literally default platformer boy into like actually kind of cool. I really like that they hide new secrets. Mm. That's cool. It's it's a little bit of that Zelda one feel where like a wall you've walked by bajillions of times suddenly has something incredible behind it, and it's like whoa! It's like whoa! Whoa, that was very robotic. Whoa, there, Biss. Uh, <laughs> Pooping. Whoa, that was very clear over your end, <laughs> Cassie. <laughs> Why? Why did you say that, Elena? Why did you sound? I mean, my best part, my favorite part is the 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 the, the double up of that that played through Cassie's microphone. Yeah. Like it was lower quality, so it sounds like you were an arcade <laughs> game, a track three. <laughs> Hey, I don't know if this is just me, but the stream, like, it keeps freezing on one frame. I think that might be our end, maybe. I don't know. Bitrate looks okay. Oh, apparently the stream about that. video is super choppy. Well, maybe it's that same issue I had on Juice World. What I like, uh, Chan says, what I like in Super Mario 64 is that you can slide around and it produces Hold on. I can massive reset my internet. dirt clouds. Wait, you're going to you're going to reset your internet in the middle of a stream? Yeah. Okay, we're back, everybody. I gotta remember to reset my internet before I stream because um, this issue happens all the time. It seems to happen when I use the internet in my room first in the game in the in the morning, where the connection is worse, and then move out here, and then the connection doesn't actually improve. Unless I completely disconnect the internet and then open it back up. Yeah, we look okay now.
Also, I realized that the game was blurry. Now it is no longer blurry. Also, I'm still waiting to connect back to Cassie and Biss. Discord has pooped. What do we see here? Well, yeah, like I said, from my room, my connection is terrible. And then when I move out of my room... Wait, why did I... I died? When I move out of my room, like, there's better connection. But the connection doesn't, like, improve unless I, like, physically reset it. Oh, am I back in the call? Yeah. Alright, we're all set. Can you hear me? Yep. Hooray! Continue. Oh my god. Me and, me and Cassie were, like, talking the entire time. So we can hear you. Did you hear me, like, through the stream, or through the call? No, 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 through the call! It was wild. Wow. This call really is a service. Yeah, it was just stuck frozen. Also, why did I die? <laughs> oh, because you can still move around here? So why he die? You walked off the edge. <laughs> Great. Anyway, let's do the thing that you wanted me to do. You died because you you decided to press left after being Bowser. Well, it's because normally inputs don't do anything at that so point. So normally you just press left to apparently. Mock Bowser. Like, look, Bowser, I'm trying to walk off the edge of my car anymore. I've yeah, apparently, I, I press can't... buttons after that point for no, some reason. Click, no, no, click on Sonic. Click I on did. Sonic. Yeah, I clicked on Sonic. Okay. No, 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 don't, no, go back. No, I mean, click on the Sonic in the thing. Don't, please, don't let go. Oh. No, okay, go back. I mean, click on Sonic like oh. you would change. Yeah, okay, now you get it. Oh, there's other Sonics. And they keep going until you find the one that looks like it'd probably be Shaggy. Just why is this in the game? <laughs> oh, and there's this. Oh, and... Oh, boy, this keeps going. Why is he doing the Fortnite dance? Get... No. <laughs> <laughs> You got There's so many of these. All right, well, every ca every character. Could you? Oh, all... Mario One style Sonic. That looks cool. What yeah. is this? Po There's a poop oh, stain on the screen. Oh, that's a gorgeous looking Sonic with the. What is this? Bis? Simple colors and the black outline. Oh, this is small. Oh, was this that is like what was that? Like Mario Three or something? That looked We're... so good. Wait, Bis. the one with the black outlines that's low resolution? It might be Sonic Pocket Adventure for the Neo Geo. Bis! Yes, Elena? What is this? Look at him <laughs> sticky <laughs> leggy <laughs> out. <laughs> that's shaggy. Stick that's my leggy shaggy. out real far. That's leggy. That's shaggy of you. Shaggy. Oh, is this like I wanna be the guy? Yeah, it's like I wanna be the guy. What's I wanna be the guy? Have you oh, never seen like, that? Oh, oh, it's like an it's like an ultra. It's like you know games where you, you unlock. Oh yeah, there's oh there's the the character from I Want to Be the Guy. This is like I Want to Be the Guy is the ultimate trial and error game. Like the entire thing is just bullshit hard challenges. It's like Cat Mario. <laughs> yeah, no, oh. no, no, I'd say it's it's got more spectacle than Cat Mario, and it's more yeah. interesting. I mean, it's from the same time, though. Oh, wow. Well, wait, oh, was there you mean, like, those games where, like, oh, every wait. time you try to look, do something... Look, there's like, Cat Mario. You get obliterated? Yes. Look, there's Cat Mario. <laughs> like, Speaking like of you which, try to jump over a pit, devil. and then, like, some spikes shoot out of the pit and you die. You try to jump over a pit, and then God dick thrusts the earth, and you're shoved down a pit by... <laughs> oh, no, this makes it play Incredible. like... This makes it play like, and then, uh, like I want to be the guy. And then, like, if you try to bait the spikes to shoot, then, like, you land back look, on the ground. <laughs> look, this modifies and then the, the game to play like that. Fall down from the sky and then land on you. <laughs> yeah, yeah, exactly. So, this, yeah. Cassie, are you looking, so then, if you uh, avoid you the spikes next, then you get, like, strangled by the grass or something. <laughs> gotcha games, they should be called gotcha. <laughs> Those this, are so oh fun. My god. Oh my those god. Feel like, this modifies the game to play like that. Like. Are you... Wait, can we, can we just appreciate it? Shan, when you played as Shaggy, sh uh, Shan was like, Are you a gun? Arrow's like, Where did Shaggy's body go? And Glitchly, <laughs> it glitchly is, is just losing it over Sniff It. 
those 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 remind me of the like um, have cartoon alts? like gag reels where oh, like they're yeah. trying to do something really simple Tails only has one alt. but they keep failing spectacularly oh, in absurd yeah, yeah, ways yeah, that yeah. couldn't be foreseen. Oh, Bess, here's one for you. <laughs> yeah, the, yeah, there's a Jitaro, there's a Jitaro Kujo and a Dio brand uh, wall on here. I love those games. They're yeah, so I want to be the guy as one of those. Who's that? I gotta play that. Oh, there's that. Uh, Freedom Planet. Wow, who is incredible. This? I don't know that character. I think that I've seen I've seen them from something. No. I don't know what. <laughs> Michael Jackson from Moonwalker. Sean is Sean is begging you what to is this? No play through. It's Eggman. I just want you to know Sean is like Okay, what the like, heck is this? Go, please. What what is this? Oh, and you might want to not I'm playing as what is this, Mac OS? You might not want to play as a new character for the first time with a skin, because it'll make it hard to figure out what they do. What the heck? No, this is like Windows. This is like Minesweeper and Ski Free. Incredible. Uh, and AOL. <laughs> what the heck? Incredible. This is... Well, you've upgraded a full color. Incredible. <laughs> and Solitaire is there. You've got mail. You've got mail. Oh, you can like boost. I see. I'm like clicking. I'm. Oh, it's like it's clicking and dragging the window to fly. Get it? What? Isn't that amazing? Yeah, that's pretty amazing. I gotta look. see this. Oh my God! You're oh, right. Oh, look at this OS. Whoa! That's what the that, hell? That this is beautiful. so inventive. I love it. <laughs> <laughs> okay, Glitchly wants to see Sniffit. Arrow says MS Paint. Shan is like Jojo, 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 Jojo. I jo, 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 jo. haven't seen all the characters yet. Okay, I want to see them all first. Oh, new Super Mario Bros. style. Oh, it's just Mario in a ton of styles. I see, and plus uh, Toadette and Toad, and also th that cat Mario. There's a cat on stream now. I'm sorry, my cat's bit. My cat gets like this sometimes, and there's nothing you can do. Okay, have Donkey Kong. There. <gasps> Bubble Bobble. I love all the sprite work in this game. Bubble Bobble. Yeah, I actually think the nice. defaults are like the most boring sprites. Look, like, it's Bubble really? Bobble. Eh, yeah. That's actually interesting. I, <sighs> I, I love think Bubble Bobble. Great. But this? I, I like the defaults personally. But that's valid. Bubble Bobble is one of my favorites. That's on NES Online. I gotta get somebody to play that with me so that I can do like the actual ending. Cause the only the real ending you can only do in multiplayer. And last time I played it, I couldn't. I didn't have anybody to do multiplayer with. Also, Elena. Um, just you know, different characters react to certain things in slightly different ways. Like, uh -huh. if if you're playing as Knuckles, um, slash JoJo, slash whoever, um, you you get long distance punches. Um, through the fire flower. If you're playing Bubble Bobble, the fire flower gives you more firepower. We'll give you Sniff It, Glitchily, because you asked first. I have a feeling this is not just Sniff It, though. Based on the picture. Oh, I guess it is. I just oh, yeah, because shooting. But I have to. This is one of the Cat Mario characters, or one of the I want to be the guy characters. So you have to play it with the, with nonsense mode. I love I love fucking Snippet doing like a wall, or like a wall slide down. Something about it feels very incongruent, and I like it. Ah, when he gets killed, <laughs> it looks like a like a, a sprite flash animation. <laughs> <laughs> now all the question mark blocks are like hazards you have to watch out for. Literally, is like <laughs> finally again. Let's see, play sniff it. Game of the year, best game. <laughs> and then we'll do JoJo for Shan, and I guess for Bis too. If Bis likes it. Yeah, oh, there's, oh, there's two different JoJo ones. Which one? Which one should I do, Bis? The yellow guy, or the, or the, or the, like green and black guy. Green and black guy. That one. Also, get a fire flower.
I'm what, gonna be you, honest, you, right? Well, <laughs> the small sprite is silly. <laughs> the small sprite is actually a reference to the episode where he fights a stand user that turns people into children. Did you know me? This is goofy. It really is. It really is. <laughs> they should really make that voice clip stack so you can hit it really fast. Wait, he's over Knuckles, right? Yeah, he's yeah. over Knuckles. So you so can he glide. glide. Yeah, he glides. Oh yeah, look, there he glides. Oh my god, when he... Was he like... Po the, the pose when he goes in the pipe? <laughs> What, what, what you can- oh, you can dig into the ground, cause Knuckles. I don't know, it looked like he was posing. Oh, so, oh yeah, that makes sense. Also, get a fire flower, please, I'm begging. Trying. Also, you can still spin dash and roll, cause you're Knuckles. But it's like a weird slide that just kills everything. Oh yeah, now I have a longer punch. Oh my god! <laughs> Oh, Shadow's having a good time, and I'm here for it. Oh, getting your stand out when you get the fire flower. Beautiful. <laughs> and you. It's pretty funny. It's kind. I'm gonna be honest, right? Like, some small parts of me almost kind of just wishes JoJo was a spoke. JoJo is a bespoke character, so he could have like a more like, instead of Halo instead of set. being a an echo fighter. Yeah. An echo fighter of Knuckles. Because, like, because, like, okay. did you say that it was easy to mod characters into this game or okay. just as skins? Reskins. Well, yeah, because this, this, this is a game maker game. Yeah. So, skins are oh, very it is? Yeah. Wait, this is a game maker game? Yeah, I'm guessing beginning. the source isn't public, though, right? Oh, no, it isn't. Shoot. That's unfortunate. Yeah, Cassie's favorite thing at the moment is playing with game maker source code. Yeah. <laughs> this it's would be fun, fun to play with. Fun with that. I'd essentially like... have a way to play with Mario 1, kinda. Shan's saying that if they had a stand, it'd be more than Oh, that was fun. Stands. You know, if I had a stand, it'd be... Okay, so I've, I've actually decided what my stand would be, right? Okay. <laughs> I think I would have, like, a humanoid stand that looks like a guard. Um... Uh, specifically, a fucking <laughs> railway guard, right? Um, yeah. And basically, my ability is if there's anything around me which resembles a pathway of some sort, or a oh line, yeah, I can summon an appropriately sized train on it. <laughs> and, and like, I've been thinking about all the dynamics of how that could be used. Like, number one, obviously, if there's a line between you and your opponent, you can summon a small train on. Knuckles line. makes this game very easy. So, to like, you know, get them, obviously. Which is the opposite like of how Knuckles was for me in Sonic that. 3. I like to imagine that it'd still be affected by things like inclines, you couldn't make it go up a- so like- you bring chalk with you. Uh, yeah, I was actually thinking about having two water guns that are glued together so you can make like a line <laughs> Wait, I forgot of what water I was doing here. Incredible. <laughs> I, I can scroll and, backwards, unlike the real Super the, Mario Bros. And there could be so many like cool set pieces, like imagine you're on actual rails in your stand train or something. And you see an act, and you see a real train coming the other way, on the same line, right? If it hits yeah. the train, the train is your stand. If this train gets destroyed, you're killed. So what oh, we do shit. is you have to jump out to the side to the neighboring line, unsummon your stand, and resummon it on this line you've just jumped to, like in mid air. If that makes sense. That's so cool. Yeah. I, I don't know much about stands because obviously I haven't seen JoJo, but I like um I like the idea you had where my stand is the baby on the Roomba. <laughs> <laughs> you can climb on okay. walls. I just okay. That. So, literally, I'm gonna be real here. Stands are kind of like an interesting thing where there's no consistent rules. There's just tendencies. Do I have to put your like, cat in the stream thumbnail now? Oh my fucking god, Mog! I hate you. <laughs> I would go- I would go and give them attention, but it's not gonna do much. They're just- I'm gonna get the inselling. When they're inselling, not gonna give them all them. <laughs> like, they, like, they come close, and I'm like, do you want a pet? And they're like, I don't want pets. And it's like, okay. But you don't want pets. <laughs> but okay, basically stands, um... 
there's no consistent rules for them, but the general gist, with exceptions, is some kind of embodiment of your own fighting spirit, which only other stand users can see, that can still affect the real world, that usually can do physical things like grabbing and punching, but also tends to have a special ability. Is this a special invincibility um, song? And if- yes, it will be. Sounds it's like in, it. It's fucking Jotaro's theme. And also, if your stand gets damaged, you get damaged. Those are the general uh. rules. Um, but then, like, there's a load of ones which have, like, exceptions or do other things. Like, there's stands Oops. that have broken- There's stands that have broken well, away from enough. their users and become Sonic autonomous. Was cool. Wasn't there a other... stand where a monkey's stand was a boat? Yeah, there was, like, an entire fucking boat which was just the stand of an orangutan. I freaking love it. <laughs> I hate that orangutan. I like how Sonic is in the title of this, but it's sort of mostly a Mario game. Well, you say that, but, but like most of the characters in this play like Sonic characters. <laughs> they, 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 they bounce off of enemies and inverse heights oh, game how banana far they for the mods and stuff. That you were talking about. Yeah. Whoa, that was a cool uh, closing screen. Or like, rather than just closing the window, like it actually like played an animation on my screen of the window like shrinking and then going out like a, when you turn off a TV. Hey, that's cool. <laughs> that's pretty great. I yes, Arrow, we do not... That. That's cool. <laughs> Number one, Shan says JoJo has top tier music, which is true. Recently, I've been listening to Fighting Gold and fucking <laughs> Great Days. Great Days is incredible. And Arrow's like, we don't talk about the orangutan. <laughs> <laughs> I'm putting that really crusty shaggy in the thumbnail of this, of course. I mean, of course you would, honey. That's the sort of thing you would do, isn't it? <laughs> I'm gonna take the sprite and blow it up really big so you can see it. <laughs> Stretch my leggy out real far. Aww. So do you feel like you're done for the night, Elena? I think so, yeah. We streamed for three hours, I think. Just about. Um, all together. That's about usual for my stream. And it was really That's popular. Big, like we had so many... That's fair, literally. That's I'm gonna be honest. Worries. I wouldn't. I wouldn't blame you if you don't watch it because I think it's really good, right? Like, I love it a lot, but also like, it like goes through different parts. Like the entire like, like main character and location changes every so often, and in my opinion, the best parts are like two and four. So it's like you have to tolerate one to get to two. You have to tolerate three to get to four. I don't know what five's like yet. I don't know if this yeah. is the original, but this is what I was this is what I was referencing. Oh! <laughs> There's like many variations of this, but this is a good one, I thought. What? Sticks Maligi out real far. <laughs> that's what that's oh, what Shaggy was doing. He was doing Sticks Maligi out real far. Oh yeah, Shan, I've heard that 5 is really good. Maz, okay, part of the reason we stuck with JoJo is Maz was like, listen, watch one episode of part 5, and then you'll know what's worth working up to. So we watched one episode of part 5, and that gave us the energy needed to power through 1. We loved 2. We tolerated 3. 4 got, go four got good about halfway through, but now I recognize that the first half was needed to set up the second. <laughs> and we're about to start part five. We're about to start looking at um golden um hair orifice boy with his <laughs> hair orifices on his head. So, um, my next stream will be Wednesday. Uh, it's going to be SpongeBob. We're going to do. Uh, we're going to try and finish Battle for Bikini Bottom. Hopefully, there will be no more emulator errors, so we don't get stuck oh. up behind a door for an hour. <laughs> Although, yeah, I sort of like dragged that out longer than necessary just because it was really i was really curious about it <laughs> it turned into let's figure out why this is acting this way stream as opposed to progressing through the game stream <laughs> but yeah we'll continue that and there was one spongebob game that we forgot which was creature from the crusty crab which we'll throw that in there um and then thursday will be link to the past and world of goo world of goo i think we will finish oh, on thursday and then, great. Yeah. and then, Biss, we got to figure out what we're streaming next Sunday because uh, we're done with Sonic 3. Eh, I'm sure we'll poop something out. <laughs> I guess you could just give me more fan games. There's always, there's like an endless supply of those. Um, 
I don't know. I'm so, I don't know. It's like I feel like after a while, you kind of get past a lot of the like noteworthy ones, and also it's like I don't want to go for the non-noteworthy ones because I'm gonna be honest. We're kind of mean even to the good ones in a way that's undeserved. <laughs> What we if we started getting into like littler things, it would feel like we were just going up to random people on the internet who have like a tiny passion project nobody's heard of and just kicking their sandcastle over. I, want to do that. <laughs> I feel like what we do already is almost kind of like pushing the bounds oh. of good taste. But oh well. <laughs> um. Oh, we got to fix the randomizer mod for uh, Sonic Adventure 2. Yeah, oh, that is something we are absolutely going to fucking do. That's, that's <laughs> we got shit. Off stream, we got to try and troubleshoot that at some point before next Sunday, maybe. Mm-hmm. Also, there's some <laughs> just good Sonic Adventure 2 level mods coming out drip occasionally, so mm-hmm. that I can shove some of those into a zip and send them to you. <laughs> Sonic Ball was very entertaining. It was entertaining in the way that it was entertaining in the way that like Mugen is entertaining. I feel <laughs> it's like the Mugen of of Mario platformer yeah. Sonic thing. <laughs> it's also the good of Mario. <laughs> I'd be up to stream Mugen someday, just because it would just be a nonsense stream of just looking at a bunch of nonsense. <laughs> you know, <laughs> those are always fun. Okay. Look at our epic Mugen stream. The thumbnail is just five different kink characters. <laughs> I used to, I have nostalgic for that game too because I had that friend where we'd play that during lunch at school. <laughs> Although I say play in quotation marks, we all we would do is just the auto mode where we just pick two characters we want to see fight and just make them fight and see who wins. That I was farted. more fun than actually trying to play it. Because <laughs> you know you don't know how to do any of the moves or anything. So it was more fun to just pit them against each other. And then, of course, there was the joke characters like Chuck Norris, who are invincible. <sighs> <laughs> they can't die. SpongeBob is in that game. I remember that. He's in the Game Boy Advance sprites. <laughs> I think it used the movie game sprites. But uh, yeah, thanks for watching, everybody. It was a good stream today. And thanks for yeah. joining yeah, you too. <laughs> I appreciate it. So I'll see you on Wednesday. Bye bye. See you on Wednesday. Good luck with game development, Glitch Lily. <laughs> bye bye. Bye bye, everybody. <laughs> <laughs>